Hi everyone and welcome to Fresh from My Garden. I have previously shared a few videos on growing ferns and how we created a fern corner in our garden. So ferns are basically plants that grow well in spots that don't receive too much of sunlight and they love a lot of moisture and humidity. So this is the rabbit foot fern mainly because of the roots or the rhizomes of the fern. When you look at the roots of the fern you can see that they have a very furry texture and resembles a squirrel's foot or a rabbit's foot. So it is commonly known as squirrel's foot or rabbit's foot fern. Just like most ferns this plant is also great for hanging baskets and this is growing in a small container which I have tied to the trunk of our jackfruit tree. So it is not basically in a hanging pot but right now since it is tied to the trunk of the tree it is growing in a trailing format and you can see that the leaves are trailing downwards and this is the fern corner that we have around our jackfruit tree. So we have a few other ferns growing in this spot in containers and also in the ground but the rabbit's foot fern is in a small container and it hasn't been repotted even after a couple of years of purchase. But it is soon getting ready to be repotted since it is getting root bound in the same container that it is growing in. But since it looks so beautiful in the garden and it is growing really well with lots of new foliage, I haven't yet repotted this fern. Ferns are usually propagated by division methods. So they are usually taken out of the container and by the root they are divided and separated so that they can grow into new plants. But since this plant has been growing really nicely in the small container, I haven't yet repotted or divided it to grow new plants in the garden. Now as I show you a closer view of the spot in which it is growing, you can see how much growth is there in that pot. And even though it is a small pot, it still continues to grow well. And has a lot of beautiful foliage and also new leaves that continue to grow. This pot is placed in the northeast side of our garden, right below our jackfruit tree, where it receives some morning sunlight and shade during the rest of the day. And it has got beautiful green, lush leaves that are growing in a trailing way, and it is growing beautifully down the length of our jackfruit tree. Most ferns are great to be grown in hanging pots and over a period of time they start trailing downwards and they look really beautiful with the lush green foliage. The main thing to take care when growing ferns is to maintain the moisture and humidity because these plants don't really like to dry out completely or they don't look as beautiful. If you haven't already watched our DIY fern corner video, please do take a look at that video on our channel and I hope you liked a view of this beautiful plant from our garden. It is growing very beautifully in spite of being in a small container just because it gets the right conditions to grow in. If you're looking for plants for your indoor spaces and also shade gardens, ferns are one of the most beautiful and easy to grow plants. Also do take a look at some ferns that I foraged from my hometown and a terrarium that we created with it. I'll share a link to all these videos in the cards above. Please don't forget to support and subscribe to our channel for more gardening related videos. Thanks for watching Fresh from My Garden.